What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Killmark Collectors. I am Brandon, and today we are talking about the future of this channel. And I'm excited about it. I think it's going to be really fun for me, for you guys. I'm looking forward to this next chapter. And I guess without further ado, let's just jump into it. When I launched this channel a year ago, I was hopeful that maybe it would get some traction and that I might end up with three or 400 subs by the end of the year. Clearly that's not what happened and I can't be more thankful for it. You guys as a community between the comments, the notes on discord, the discussions that we've had during live streams, this past year has been absolutely incredible. And I want to start by saying thank you guys so much for paying attention to my ramblings and somehow thinking that I know what I'm talking about. It's been an incredible journey and I can't wait to build on it from here. But let's talk about what that actually means. And when I say build, there's really kind of three goals that I have for this channel and, and really for me as a creator. The first one is that I just want to get back to my roots a little bit with some of the storytelling and, and being a little bit more creative um, in the way that I'm uh, portraying content. Now, if you guys saw some of my earlier videos about like the devs on the balance patches, some of the shorts that I've done, you'll know that I enjoy kind of the, the playful com comic parody, comedic parody. I don't know if that's the right word, but either way, it's just, it's been a fun medium. And with Eve Echoes releasing, hopefully, the cinematic view and some of the stuff that we think is coming out, I think there's a lot of opportunity for that type of content. So I'm really hoping that I'll be able to actually do that. Maybe in like a red versus blue type of way, if you've ever seen that, or if you're old enough to remember <laughs> the old, old Halo webcomic things. Um, but either way, I just would love to get back more to doing a little bit more of that, not as a replacement, but potentially just as something to, to kind of supplement some of the other content that I'm doing. Now, the second goal that I have here is to actually expand and start looking at some other games. And this is as much from a personal perspective and the fact that I've been playing the same game for about a year and a half, which is longer than I've ever played a mobile game by far. Um, and just kind of knowing myself and the way that I continue to evolve as a player, um, as it is from a content creation standpoint. Now, I know that a lot of people will probably see this and say, oh, you're leaving Eve Echoes or what about Eve Echoes or anything like that. That's not the case. I still have a lot of videos and things like that that I'm planning to release and that I'm really looking forward to actually building in the new year. But from a diversification standpoint and honestly, just from a I don't want to get bored and burned out with Eve Echoes, I am looking to play some other stuff. That, of course, brings up the next question, which is going to be what is that next game? And for me, that is going to be Mech Arena. This is a like a, a mech shooter. Uh, if you ever played Mech Assault way back in the day, um, you basically build giant robots, you go fight. It's a lot of fun. I've been playing for about three or four days at this point, um, and I'm really enjoying it and, and really enjoying some of the progression and the PvP aspect of things. Matches are short, they're quick, they're fun. I can autopilot to Jita and then play two or three games while that autopilot is going on. So it just feels like a fun kind of palette cleanser. I'm really looking forward to kind of diversifying out and doing some live streams and, and showing you guys some of the cool stuff that's going on in that game as well as Eve Echoes. Again, this is not to poo-poo on Eve or anything like that, but more of just to kind of help me as a creator expand a little bit and evolve so that I can continue to give you guys some good content regardless of what the game is. The last goal that I really have for 2022 is to be more interactive. And this is something that I have kind of noticed and what I enjoy about YouTube um, it is very collaborative. You guys are great about leaving comments. I love talking with you guys and, you know, going back and forth on Discord or, you know, again, in the comment section or on live streams. And I want to do more of that, regardless of if it's in Eve Echoes or Mech Arena. I'm really looking forward to actually being able to, to play more with you guys, to uh, jump into games, have discussions in Discord, whether it's in my Discord on the Killmark Collectors channel, if it's in you know YouTube comment section, whatever it is, I do want to be more intentional and I want to include you guys in more. I'm going to be doing more polls about what types of videos you guys want to see so that I can really make sure that we're having kind of a back and forth dialogue 
Um, and it's not just me kind of screaming into the void and hoping that you guys like what I'm putting out. So those are my three big goals for this year. I think it also kind of goes without saying that I want to continue to provide the quality and improve the quality. You guys can see I'm in my new studio. Um, I've still got some work to do here to figure out the set and what everything's going to look like. But overall, I think this is a, a step in the right direction. And I'm really looking forward to kind of where I'm going to be able to take this channel moving forward. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks so much for joining. Let me know down in the comments below what you think about uh, kind of these goals and the direction. Is there something else that you'd like to see? Kind of starting with goal number three and being a little bit more interactive. Are there things that you would like to see? Is there more that you would like me to be focusing on? Or is there even maybe another game that you're really enjoying that you think I should try out? Leave me a note down in the comments below. I would love to, again, just kind of have some of that dialogue and really start the year off on a good foot. So with that being said, thanks so much for joining. I appreciate you guys, again, more than you know. I did not expect to be making this video one year after my first video. So I'm really pumped. I'm really stoked with the direction of the channel and the future of the channel. I can't wait to take this journey with you guys. So thanks so much. Fly safe. And remember, Kill Mark's last forever.